What's up, Three Pound Fishing Nation? I've got a great episode for you today, man. We are finally in the fall and the fish are biting. Big fish, small fish. On my home lake, just about everything's biting right now and it is an exciting time, so you gotta love the fall bite. I mean, I wanna be up that deer stand just like everybody else, but uh, to get me off the water, I, I know you feel the same way. It's tough and uh, I love to take advantage of the fall bite. But today, I've got something special I'm gonna share with you right off the bat when we get started. Uh, but first, let's get out there, let's get set up, and some exciting stuff starting here at Three Pound Fishing for 2023. Let's start her up right here. Ooh, baby, bass cat. That thing sounds good, dang. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies. All right, you gotta love straightening up there, the fall fishing, folks. You know, I, it's just it's just a fun time. I love every transition from one season to the next. To me, that's the great thing about fishing is those changes. You know, you can fish like this, like we're gonna do a little bit today, but you fish like that for a long time and you just can't wait for the seasons to change so that you can go after kind of a different fish, right? You know, during the fall time, as those waters cool, those fish are gonna become way more aggressive. And right now we're sitting at 72 degree water temperature, which is still kind of warm. Um, I like to think that the fish really start getting aggressive in that 50, basically that 50 degree water temperature, I think is the is the money. Ooh, baby, hold on. Well, you guys don't see me typically doing that unless we're in a tournament setting, but we have a new net sponsor. And I'm gonna share that with you right here, folks. Check that out, folks. That's a good starter fish for the evening. And uh, I don't typically fish for, or I don't typically fish with nets when I'm casual fishing, but I do bring them on my guide trips. And I certainly always bring them during tournaments. So I wanna introduce you guys to Hog Fishing hogfishing.com check them out they're a new sponsor for 2023 i've played a very big part in designing of these of these poles and the great thing about them massive massive basket 300 and i believe 50 square inches in a way that no other net can i'm just telling you it's just a great design and um, the fantastic what makes them super unique is that they're all interchangeable you'll notice the blue rod here i'm sorry the blue pole you'll also notice the the red hoop and red net. Well, folks, there's a lot of options. Let's go through them. So let's start off with the poles, okay? 25 ounces, there are three options, a three foot, a six foot, and a six to 12 foot extension. Again, hog fishing, this is the red one. It extends from six to 12 inches, and it is super smooth, just awesome. Shines in the, I mean, the, in the sun, it's unbelievable. We also have a black one here. I don't think I brought them all here. A silver one, our nice green one right there. So when you start to mess with all the nets, green hoop and net, silver hoop, clear net, blue hoop, blue net, red hoop, red net. There's also a black, a silver with a black net. You get all these variations and it actually comes up to 120 variations, 25 variations, because we actually do sell the net, colored nets individually in a red, blue, and a green comes out to 125 variations of color, style, you name it, folks, you can make it happen. Check this out here. The great thing is that now you can match your pole with whatever you like. Here's a green on green. I think we call this the green meanie, but basically, again, this is, these are all the six to 12 extension poles here, but that is just, come on now. That's just, that's just sharp. Just looks really pretty. Now, you know, I got a, a red, black, and gray boat. So I think I'm gonna go with the red hoop. I think this is gonna be the choice in my boat right here. Now I can put this on a black pole and it probably do just as well. Everybody knows sickness, man. Sickness is like, a, we gotta coordinate, we gotta look good. Plus we got these big hoops, we got these great nets. They're light, 25 ounces, 13 ounces for the hoops. And again, 
this might match my boat even better but now you have options and you can have options out there on the water you can match your jersey this would actually be a great ozark rod now you get the point now you can have style good net lightweight does everything you want so check them out at hogfishing.com and it really is an incredible high quality product so check them out let's put some fish in the boat oh now that is a small guy <laughs> and you're gonna get just about everything during the fall time let me put you guys on some active captain i want you guys to see what i'm seeing so check this out folks see how they've kind of separated themselves from the pile right there They'll start to do that in the fall as this water temperature changes they won't be so tucked in there and those top fish not all they're not always aggressive but most of the time they can be and um, look at that that did not take long and we're just going to use our new fancy net and again extremely lightweight you gotta love it I went with the Ozark rod version. I got their shirt on, I got their hat on. I say, why not? Not a big fish, but a lot of fun. The fall time is just an incredible uh, opportunity. I'll keep saying that. Now, guide trips are going great. Um, a lot of guide trips this week. Um, there is definitely availability left in November, which I'll be honest with you, I think November is the key month. Uh, anytime, like again, we have to get that water temperature down to 50, in my opinion, is ideal. You know, I always tell people the difference between my lake and some of these others, it's a tick. It's not a thump. Um, for the most part, it is a tick. Very quick bite, a very uncommitted fish, and that makes it a little bit more difficult for the most part. Ooh, a lot of short strikes. We still got it on active captain, so you still. But you can see how they're really grouped up. And this is it's a piece of natural structure down there. And I just I cast it out there and there it comes in right there. And sometimes I play the fish big time, you know. I'm and there we go. good fish we're going to our next stop but i will let you know that on the hogfishing.com website check it out you can build your own net you get to choose your own hoop you get to choose your own pole and you can put them together i believe this one's called the american you know makes sense but um you can build them on your own but at the same time they have already made out some to make it easy on people so, you know, if you get on there and you're curious what they might look like, there's pictures of just a ton of, um, of nets so that you get an idea what they look like. So that's a red net on a blue handle. That's, that's pretty hot. Check that out. I believe it's called the American. It might be the vice versa. It might be a red pole with a red net. But check out the red on red. This is crazy. This is called Ruby. Red on red. Red on red. The thing just absolutely pops. Is crazy good looking. Maybe that's the one I need to go for. Now, if you're interested in a guide trip, give me a holler, guys. November's got some availability and I'm trying to fill those dates up. And don't forget about the crazy good winter fishing on my home lake. We uh, we have a ball. Right now, these fish are really at any depth. I was catching them all day today. Um, 20 at, at 8. I mean, it was just, it was nuts. And um, it didn't seem to matter right there good fish and um, but that's fall fishing and it gets even better as the winter goes on um, I think the fish honestly get bigger um, obviously they're feeding up but I think a lot of the bigger fish become a little bit more active why I don't know but I can just tell you that it continues to get better 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 but as you can see he just got off as you can see it's pretty much every cast um, About it I'll tell you as you can see that is the 32nd ounce three pound fishing jig head right there there is the number seven split shot Fish, 
folks. Really good fish. Check out hogfishing.com. All the big stores are gonna have them. You can call Grizzly, PTG. They should have them. If not, ask for them. They will have them. A lot of stores are gonna be carrying. You're gonna see a lot of the hog fishing nets out there on the trails. People that wanna have a little bit more style and that hoop is just the perfect size. I can't say enough good things about it. Um, Crazy. And this fall fishing is insane. <laughs> Again, that's the red on red. <laughs> You got all these poles to choose from. Mix, match, 125 variations, different nets. There's actually a tutorial on the website that shows you how to take the net on and off um, so that you can change the net colors with the other hoop uh, colors. So there's just a lot of options that you can look good in your boat, match your jersey, match your shirt. Like I said, came up with the Ozark rod one right there. That was easy. Bam! Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great one. Thanks for watching 3 Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.